Sunan an Nasai, the Book of Presents, an Nehal. Footnote An Nehal, or Presents. Most of the linguists explain that it is something given without expecting something in return. Similar was stated by Ibn Hajar in explanation of Numbers 2586 to 2587 of Al Bukhari. It is often used as a synonym for other words that mean gift. Chapter on Different Versions of the Report of Noman bin Bashir Concerning Presents. It was narrated from An Noman bin Bashir that his father gave him a slave as a present. Then he came to the Prophet, peace be upon him, to ask him to bear witness to that. He said, Have you given a present to all of your children? He said, No. He said, Then take it back. This wording is that of one of the narrators, Muhammad. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. Comments 1. The tie of relationship between children and father is very close. A slight diversion of it becomes the cause of many evils. Hence, there is guidance from the divine law that a man ought to treat his children equally so that no one has the feeling of deprivation. Giving a present to one son only might create a feeling of hatred among the other sons toward this son, to whom the present was given, and the father, and its consequences could be formidable. That is why one is forbidden from indulging in such practices, and it has been commanded that a man ought to treat his children equally in giving presents, and not prefer some over others. If one desires to give, each one should be given equally. There is, however, disagreement over whether a daughter and a son be given equally or a son should be given twofold, as is done in the case of inheritance. 2. This equality is only in the matter of gifts and presents. So far as the disbursement of maintenance remains, therein the portion shall be decided accordingly. For instance, each one's expenses concerning food, drink, clothes, education, and marriage, etc. cannot be equal. These would be governed by necessity. It was narrated from An-Numan bin Bashir that his father brought him to the messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, and said, I have given my son a slave of mine as a present. The messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, Have you given a present to all of your children? He said, No. The messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, Then take your present back. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. Comments. In an authentic hadith, taking back a present after giving is forbidden, but a father may take it back from his own children. It was narrated from An-Numan bin Bashir that his father Bashir bin Sa'ad brought An-Numan with him and said, O Messenger of Allah, I have given this son of mine a slave who belonged to me as a present. The Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, Have you given a present to all your children? He said, No. He said, Then take your present back. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. It was narrated from Bashir bin Sa'ad that he brought an numan to the Prophet peace be upon him and said, I want to give this son of mine a slave as a present and if you think that I should go ahead with it, I will go ahead. The Messenger of Allah peace be upon him said, Have you given a present to all your children? He said, No. He said, Then take your present back. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. It was narrated from an numan bin Bashir that his father gave him a present. And his mother said, Ask the Prophet, peace be upon him, to bear witness to what you have given to my son. So he came to the Prophet, peace be upon him, and told him about that, and the Prophet, peace be upon him, did not want to bear witness to it. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. Comments 1. In order to make him, the Prophet, peace be upon him, a witness lest other sons might begin to dispute it in future. 2. The Prophet, peace be upon him, did not like to bear witness over it because it was an injustice, and to bear witness over injustice is synonymous with participation in the act of injustice. It was narrated from Bashir that he gave his son a slave as a present. Then he came to the Prophet, peace be upon him, and he wanted the Prophet, peace be upon him, to bear witness to that. He said, Have you given a similar present to all of your children? He said, No. He said, Then take your present back. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. It was narrated from Hisham bin Urwa from his father that Bashir came to the Prophet peace be upon him and said, O Prophet of Allah, I have given An-Numan a present. He said, Have you given something to his brothers? He said, No. He said, Then take it back. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. It was narrated that An-Numan said that his father took him to the Prophet peace be upon him and said, Bear witness that I have given An-Numan such and such of my wealth as a gift. He said, Have you given all your children a present like that which you have given to An-Numan? This hadith is graded sahih or authentic.
It was narrated from Anuman that his father brought him to the Prophet, peace be upon him, to bear witness to a present that he gave to him. He said, Have you given all your children a present like that which you have given to him? He said, No. He said, I will not bear witness to anything. Will it not please you if they were all to treat you with equal respect? He said, Of course. He said, Then no, I will not do it. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. An-Numan bin Bashir al-Ansari narrated that his mother, the daughter of Rawaha, asked his father to give some of his wealth to her son. He deferred that for a year, then he decided to give it to him. She said, I will not be pleased until you ask the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, to bear witness. He said, O Messenger of Allah, the mother of this boy, the daughter of Rawaha, insisted that I give a gift to him. The Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, O Bashir, do you have any other children besides this one? He said, Yes. The Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, Have you given all of them a gift like that which you have given to this son of yours? He said, No. The Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, Then do not ask me to bear witness, for I will not bear witness to unfairness. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. Comments Call me not as witness. This does not signify that one should call someone else as witness. Rather, this is a way of scolding not to do such a thing. It occurs in the Quran. Let then him who wills believe in it and let him who wills reject it. Quran Surah Al-Kahf chapter 18 verse 29. That is why it was called injustice and injustice is forbidden. It was narrated that An-Numan said, My mother asked my father for a gift and he gave it to me. She said, I will not be contented until you ask the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, to bear witness. So my father took me by the hand as I was still a boy and went to the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him. He said, O Messenger of Allah, the mother of this boy, the daughter of Ravaha, asked me for a gift, and she wanted me to ask you to bear witness to that. He said, O Bashir, do you have any other child apart from this one? He said, Yes. He said, Have you given him gifts like that which you have given to this one? He said, No. He said, Then do not ask me to bear witness, for I will not bear witness to unfairness. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. It was narrated that Amir said, I was told that Bashir bin Saad came to the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, and said, O Messenger of Allah, my wife Amra bin Tarawaha told me to give a gift to her son Numan, and she told me to ask you to bear witness to that. The Prophet, peace be upon him, said, Do you have any other children? He said, Yes. He said, Have you given them something like that which you have given to this one? He said, No. He said, Then do not ask me to bear witness to unfairness. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. It was narrated from Abdullah bin Utbah bin Masood that a man came to the Prophet, peace be upon him, and said, I have given a gift to my son, so bear witness. He said, Do you have any other children? He said, Yes. He said, Have you given them something like that which you have given him? He said, No. He said, Shall I bear witness to unfairness? This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. An-Numan bin Bashir said, My father took me to the Prophet peace be upon him to ask him to bear witness to something that he had given to me. He said, Do you have any other children? He said, Yes. He gestured with his hand held horizontally like this saying, Why don't you treat them all equally? This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. An-Numan said, When he was delivering a khutbah, my father took me to the Messenger of Allah to ask him to bear witness to a gift that he had given me. He said, Do you have any other children besides him? He said, Yes. He said, Treat them equally. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic. An-Numan bin Bashir delivered a khutbah and said, The Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, Treat your children fairly. Treat your children fairly. This hadith is graded sahih or authentic.